That's great. I'm proud of you. Yeah, I, I mean, I guess it is. I mean, there's a lot of major changes going on in my life right now. Or, I mean, changes are happening. Um, like, I mean, I know that it's God. And you've helped me out a lot, too. And my small group, I've been spending a lot of time with them. And that's been really good. Uh, you know, we talked a few weeks ago about you didn't have any margin in your life. You didn't have any time for your husband, your family. Uh, how's that going now? Uh, well, like we talked about, I cut some things out. I started slowing down and making time for God and for other people. And it's weird because I've always been so focused on my own agenda and on me. And now I'm not. And I've been doing a lot of stuff with my small group, like, we're doing this service project right now with this um, these single moms who don't really have a lot of time, and we're making meals for them. And so I do that a couple times a week, and I've been donating furniture that I don't need. And this Saturday, we're having a yard sale for this family who's been out on the streets, and they're getting themselves back together. And it's just really awesome. And I've never done anything like this before, but I guess it just makes you wonder. About what? About why we think certain things are so important. And the things that really are important, we just throw them away with both hands. And I cut my very first tide check this Sunday. That's totally not like me, just giving money away. But it wasn't nearly as painful as I thought it would be. It actually felt good. Giving my money away to something, I don't know, something more important, gave me this sense of significance. And people who used to know me, they're noticing these changes in my life and they're asking me what's happened. And... I don't really know what to tell them. It's like, for the first time in my life, I'm really living. I think you are. And the ironic thing about it is, it sounds like what you're doing is really dying. <laughs>